certainly has felt like winter the past few days and local transportation officials say they are ready for whatever the winter season has in store. 12 News meteorologist Katie McNeil joins us now in studio with the details. Katie. Well, earlier today, Governor Dan McKee and RIDOT Director Peter Alvedi held a press conference discussing their readiness plan for this winter, which includes adding 26 brand new snowplow trucks to their fleet. These new plows, which cost $5 million, are ready to withstand the elements. Some high-tech features, which include anti-corrosion technology, weather sensors, which communicate roadway conditions, and ice sensors, are all aimed to better equip plow drivers to handle inclement weather as well as maximize efficiency. Keep in mind, we, don't just, we didn't just buy these for the snow plowing capabilities. They're also equipped with de-icing. So anytime there's black ice uh, or uh, icing conditions. They're out there nights, weekends, 24-7 uh, if they have to. With this in mind, Governor McKee mentioned how important safety is with plows on the road and what to expect if you're driving when plow drivers are working. Snow plows travel slowly, they make wide turns, stop often, uh, and they overlap lanes and, and exit uh, the road frequently. So we have to make sure that as we see vehicles that are plowing our streets and our highways that we respect their space. McKee also mentioned some safety tips, including keeping winter gear and a scraper in your car in order to best be prepared during potentially hazardous conditions. When you're on the road, slow down. It's harder to control or stop your vehicle on a slick or snow covered surface. And Director Alvini says with the 65,000 tons of salt they have stored, as well as the 425 plow trucks on standby, RIDOT is ready to tackle any winter storms that come our way this season. In studio, I'm meteorologist Katie McNeil, 12 News.